Oh, oh, yes. Oh, okay. He's starting to look a little bit like Mike. He's starting to look a little bit like Mike right here. What it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Mike from NYC. And we back with another reaction. Today, we are watching Michael Jordan NCAA tournament highlights and top plays. It's going to be interesting to see. I feel like how MJ transitioned from like, you know, because like realistically, if you think about it, right? Mike went from, damn, I need more space. Mike went from not making the freshman varsity team and the sophomore to making it junior year to making it senior year to three years in college. So like those five years, those must have been like elite. So I feel like it's gonna be interesting to see like how his game developed within those within these three years in college. And I remember Vince Carter saying like he didn't even jump his high like or Vince Carter was saying about himself that Vince Carter didn't even jump his highest in the NBA. Like, he jumped his highest in high school. And I can see that. Like, I understand, like, when you're in high school, you literally don't, you're not in no pain. Like, as a 22-year-old, as a like, my ankles, like, they get a little, like, I feel my ankles more. Like, I just wasn't feeling it in high school like that. Like, in high, 16, 17, 18, 18, I wasn't, I wasn't feeling nothing. You know what I'm saying? I might be a little bit sore, but the next day, you know what I'm saying? I'm good. By the time practice come around again, I'm good. You feel me? So, I'm interested to see how he looks in college. Six five. He wouldn't need six six. But he was starting though. MJ. Y'all giving up the mid range? They giving it up like that? MJ. Back door, these fundamentals right here. Some light, you know what I'm saying? We're not really trying to dominate. We just trying to play basketball. Feel me? I get doubled in the corner, give it up. We push the rock on the wing. Strong take. We're not even really dunking a rock like that. We kind of just going through the motions, playing ball. This freshman year, you gotta remember. So he 18, 19. He's only two years out from not making the from from not making the basketball team. You know, he's kind of just like, just getting right. Nothing too crazy. He looks pretty, he looks pretty regular. You know? Mike, weak side. You know how to giving up the, the mid-range. Ew. Yeah, that, yeah, that's definitely not the Mike that i seen in the league. That just goes to show, though. He tried to use the damn backboard on that shot. That shit was ugly. Okay. Good rebound. Shit. I'm thinking like, yo, if I'm 6'5", I feel like I can do this. He not, he not doing nothing that's super special. Double. Easy. They giving up the easy shots. Good rebound. Mmm, good move. Okay. Okay, we developing a little bit. The footwork I see coming into play a little bit. I can't even tell which one is Mike all the time. Ooh. He not even really dunking people for real, though. Because I would think that a college Jordan would just be more naturally, athletically gifted as an 18-year-old, 19-year-old, you know? I would think that he would just be more athletically gifted, like, just ready to just dunk on people. Easier. 
Where's MJ? That shit was cash. Wow. That shit was cash. That shit didn't hit no room. First team All American. Oh, gosh. Uh oh. The mid range is looking a lot better. He's looking real comfortable with that mid range now. Oh no, MJ. That's an example of his athletic ability. He ran right past the basketball. He was dribbling, turned around and picked it up and shot it in the face of three Duke defenders. Well, they like to work it with Jordan. Or Perkins, either one. Jordan on a drive off the dribble back to them. Michael Jordan with his fourth point. In. Sophomore that scored over 1,100 points for North Carolina. That's never happened before. Well, you told me it's a physical conference. The alley up to Jordan. Jordan is fouled by Contact. That has turned on the North Carolina fans, and it could turn on the North Carolina team. A sensational alley hoop. Ella Miller. Well, I think he's going to have to make it. The well, side. he should have anticipated this. Jordan inside goes for it. Michael Jordan goes for the score. So what they do is they relax you, and then they put the zinger. With a great move, but he couldn't capitalize. And pick up the two pointer. Darty weaving back and forth. Score tied at 11. Why do you keep leaving him open? For the Tar Heels. And Carolina has the lead. Was he not like the best player on the team yet? Basketball fortunes. North Carolina appears to try to. Good cut. Good back door. That was good stuff. I think this is probably when Jordan, because a really underestimated part of Jordan's game is his off the ball ability. But in co when he was in college, he had to do a lot of that. I think that might be. I think somebody did comment that like that is an under or underrated part of Jordan's game, and it really is his ability to move without the rock. Uh oh. <laughs> 16 fouls on Georgia, so both sides will pay the bonus the rest of the way for the first half. There's an alley -oop. Damn. Jordan with his second alley -oop. And again, the North Carolina band on a scale of 1 to 10, I think they love it. He, they think he's in a high diving meet. Somebody put a 9 up there. I don't believe that. Oh, that's a 10. That other one was a 10, too, I think. Georgia doing a good job jamming up the middle, preventing Carolina from getting that ball inside to Brad Dorty. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, okay. He's starting to look a little bit like Mike. He's starting to look a little bit like Mike right here. He's starting to look a little bit like Mike. A little bit, though. Oh. Not all the way, though. Not all the way. A little bit like Mike. And he was fouled. Not all the way, though. Georgia doing a job on the offensive boards. That shot by Crosby deflected. Here comes Carolina. Down to Jordan. Yes. Yet another slam. His third. Michael Jordan is filling it up. 23 points. I don't think that they would have. Dee Smith uh, not Now he moving. Now he moving. Uh, get to a spot. Jordan has been quiet for a while. Now he getting to, now he getting to it. I had a little pressure on me at the beginning of the year, but... So once we got to conference play, I started concentrating on playing for myself and not for the fans. And, you know, so far I have been playing well. I've been more consistent defensively and, you know, offensively. I think I've been consistent. 
This was his last year. It's interesting. I don't see Jordan. I didn't see a lot of Jordan in the NBA doing floaters. I don't see him doing a lot of floaters. He just booming people. Yeah, he been practicing. Cause freshman from freshman to junior year, bruh, you can tell, bruh. You can tell. He like, man, give me that rock. He rocking off the rip now. He going crazy. Where Mike at? Mike on the block? That's crazy back door. Screen, back door is going to be there. Good catch. Mmm. Now he feeling himself. Now he feeling like that guy. You could tell, like he just the way he running back on defense. When he was a freshman, he wasn't running back on defense like that. You could look, look, uh, bump, fate. You feel me? Get that little, feel me? Let him know what you did. Freshman year wasn't moving like that. Freshman year, you had down, you know, get back on D. You know, now he on the block. He and you hit some of these right here. It's a whole different, it's a whole different energy. It's a whole different energy. Where Mike at? Mike. Oh, that's not Mike. Dump that. Oh, now he booming people. He probably dunked somebody one time and he was like, wait a minute. I could really I could really boom people on a regular. He probably just boomed somebody one time. It'll probably just play right here. He boomed somebody. He was like, oh wait a minute, and one. That's pretty light. Where Mike at? Set the screen for Mike. Uh oh, mid-range. Come on, can't give me the mid-range. You know what I do in the mid-range. Why would you even give me that? On oh, double team. Good D, Mike. Good double team, Mike. You see Mike on the wing? Give it up. Uh-huh. Pump fake. Excuse me. No pat. Now we now we learning to score on three. One, we've kind of mastered one. You know what I mean? We've mastered the fundamentals off the ball, catch and shoot, you know, spacing, backdoor, cutting, you know. Oh, we've, you know, we've got the fundamentals. Now we went down to the block. Cause I'm, I am six five, and I, I, am, I can't jump out the building. You feel me? So go ahead, go down to the block. You feel me? Get the footwork right. Hit him with a little jump as high as you can. Hit the mid range. Now we on the break. Give me the rock. Pump fake him out the way. That's one. Go over two. Now we know. Now we scoring on three. Now we, now we creating a science. Why are you not shooting that? Why wouldn't you shoot that, Mike? It's there, Mike. Give me that. Alley, that's easy, Alley. Now he's dunking everything. Uh oh. Uh oh. There it is. There's the uh there's uh Michael Jordan college for you right there. You did that I mean you did see a lot. I, I saw a lot at least in a 10 minute video. You did see a lot, you know. Cause really his first two years he wasn't really dunking the ball, he was just laying it up. You know what I mean? He was just, you know, taking what the defense gave him. And then when those last couple of clips, you started to see like I right, I'ma get what I want. You know what I'm saying? Like it's one thing to get what you giving out. But then there's a thing to get what you want. It's like when you go to a restaurant, right? It's, it's a different mentality, left side of the menu, right? When you go to a restaurant, most people, they say, you know, what can I get for you today? Can I see a menu? What do you guys have? 
you know, that's getting what you feel is available. But some people go to a restaurant, they don't want to see a menu. Like, yo, I know what I want. Like, I don't care what you serve. I know what I want. And if I get what I want, people will be blessed accordingly. So, like, somebody going to get blessed accordingly to the, to the blessing. Like, the measure that you give shall be given on to you. The measure that you give me what I want shall be blessed. You shall be blessed in that same measure. You feel me? So, you know, you can tell, like, when he was first rookie or freshman, you know, he was just filling the lane, you know, whenever the catch and shoot was there, all of that type of stuff, you know, and then really the sophomore year, you saw a little bit more defense, um, but really the junior year when he got drafted, you saw, you saw why he went third because it was like, not only did he develop his post game, you can see his confidence is different and his attitude, you know, the, um, the intensity was there. He started dunking more. You know, I, I don't know if I would say that he was more athletic between 19 and 21 or whenever he was drafted, but it's more of a mentality, you know, it's more of like, you know, it's really more of a mentality. But anyway, definitely like, comment, share, and subscribe. You like these type of videos and I'll see you when I see you. Peace.